saying that you have a limited connection is not a good excuse, especially with the videos you upload. I'm pretty sure those are really large, okay? And you don't need a full install to download wide stuff, okay? You just need to have some partial files, which you can do on your own. It just take a little longer because you have to let the launcher load for a little while and make sure it downloads the stuff and make and, and stop it when it starts to download the one or two gigabyte file stuff. Once it starts doing that, close out the launcher, then you're good. That's all you got to do. Or just a working case of example, just download the link I'll give. And once you open it up, it has this stuff in it. Make a new folder somewhere on wherever you want. Uh, wow, stuff. Okay. Drag and drop all this crap into here. Modify the cast Explorer config. Notepad plus plus or something. Uh, yeah, go away. All right, and then uh, close this one out. And just put the directory that it's in on here. Make sure you end it with a backslash. All right, and then make sure you leave the online mode as true. Even if you leave it false, if you don't have it in your install, which here is basically what it's going to look at for the install. If you don't have it, it's gonna look online anyway. So even if this is false, it doesn't matter. But once you run this, the way how it's set up is it doesn't have the uh, the the, uh, the patch info. So when so this box will come up and ask you what what version do you want to pull from? Do you want to pull from the latest one? Do you want to pull from an earlier one? Your choice. But what let's just do for the first one. When you do that, it's going to download stuff and it's going to download stuff into this folder. All right. And uh, as you can see from my thing, as soon as I pull it up, it's downloading something. This is downloading from the Blizzard server. As you know, Blizzard's uh, online storage isn't exactly fast, so it might take a while to download stuff, okay? And once it downloads those things, so it has to download a 50 megabyte file, then it has to download a 23 megabyte file, and I guess I'll have another option to download these as well if you want so you don't have to but it's the same thing it, it, even if I compress it I don't save a whole lot of size so like what's the compression size not a whole lot right so it's still pretty damn large so yeah just waste the time so just download it as you go and once that's downloading once you don't have to download it again so yeah, and I and I have a pretty pretty large list file, not the full one. This one was for like the initial version of six point two when it first came out. If I run this again, it doesn't have to do the indices again, but it has to still load stuff in. So, all right. So as you can see, it loads a lot faster because it doesn't have to download the indices anymore. But yeah, okay. And then once it does that, reads a list file. And if you go to extract stuff from here, it's going to take a long time because it has to download the files okay because you don't have the full install like I don't have the full install in here naturally so it's not gonna do that but if I wanted to download something and it will take time all right so like I'll just download something really large and I could show you uh, what I'm talking about okay so uh, like Dren or wherever that's at uh, right here if I could if I start to try to download this there's a big map. Okay, hit OK. It's gonna take a long time because it's gonna download a lot of shit. If I go to that folder and stuff, and yeah, so it's using 20% of 162, uh, which is not my connection speed. My connection speed is 50. So yeah. But 50 equals, yeah, what you guessed is 5 megabits. So that's what I have. But I'm just saying, you don't need the full one unless you're trying to grab like a full map. There's no reason to say that you have a limited speed if you're just grabbing small assets. All right, bye.